All right, it's time for Seattle Sips, where we highlight amazing drinks in our area. Yes, today we are joined by Paul Odom and Max Mesmer with Fonte Coffee Roaster. Welcome! Thank you. Thank we are you. so excited to have you here. You have some great stuff. So, Fonte Coffee Roaster, local independent roaster founded in 1992, and you actually just opened Fonte Bar. Tell us about that. Well, we opened up the bar, to, the Fonte Bar at Rainier Square to make the perfect scenario for anyone's day. You start in the morning with us and you finish the evening with us. The morning time, you have the cappuccino, and the evening time, the espresso martini. That's cool. Oh. That, and so, so this encourages people to come uh, a couple times a day. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. So <laughs> you always know where to go. You That's got the right. coffee during the day, the cocktails for people at night. What can people find on the menu during the, you know, throughout the day, during the gap there? Or even during the morning and the night? Well, in the morning, if you feel like you, you want a, a beautiful omelet, we'll have a beautiful omelet for you. In the afternoon, if you want steak tartare, we'll do steak tartare. In the evening, if you'd like to have steak florentine, we can do steak florentine. What, what? Whatever, wow. whatever, whatever you want, we, we do. Is that challenging <laughs> to kind of figure out a menu like this here for, for a kind of a unique establishment like your guys's? I, I think that the, uh, we've been doing this for a long time, 30 uh -huh. years with chefs and that all around the country, so it's not that much of a mystery to what people want. I so. love it. All right, so we're actually going to make a couple of your cocktails. So where are we starting here? We're going to start right here. We've uh, partnered with Grey Goose uh, to make our uh, Fonte F2 espresso martini. And if you'd like, I can start shaking. Let's and, do it. Uh, yeah, we'll let's start, do we'll start today right for you guys. Okay. Yes, right. <laughs> right. I already Perfect. had normal coffee, so an espresso now, martini now right, sounds keep it going. about right. You just yeah. got to keep it going. <laughs> we're good to go. Yeah. So it's good to start the morning right. Yes, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> This is really fun. And while you're starting to work on this, I have to point out those delicious pastries, not just props. You guys made those. Yes, ma'am. We have our bakery over at our 8th Avenue location, and uh, we make those fresh daily and deliver them to our stores daily. So any one of our locations has those in there seven days a week. What's your favorite out of those? You were, uh, you, during the break, you were telling us about a couple of them. Yeah, my, my favorite. three favorite on there, I, I'm a PB&J guy at heart. And yeah. so this one right here, um, yeah, I think Reese's Peanut Butter Cup, the chocolate shell with the peanut butter inside with a swirl of jam. That's I mean, right guy, come right, on. Right here. Yep. Yep. Your, your inner kid can't deny that. <laughs> yeah. All right, so we put some gray goose in here. Some gray goose. And this is our coffee liqueur. This seems, is this pretty easy to make overall? No, you can only get it at our bar. It's very Ever. difficult. Okay. You can't make this at home. You've got to come see us. Absolutely. That's a media prepped man. People. Absolutely. Uh, this is a shot of our F2 espresso. We pulled it a little bit ago. See, I can't. Now, normally that no. espresso would be pulled for that drink. Yes. Okay. Oh, so it's not There's just There's like an espresso machine yeah. dedicated just for the espresso martini okay. on the bar. All right. All right. You've got to have fresh espresso when you do this. Yeah. yeah. All right. So here we go. Who's starting us off I'm going to start us off oh, Okay, here yep. we go. Now we're talking. You All woke right. up earlier than me, I so did. you deserve the coffee drink. Exactly. And we're going to give you a little coffee bean garnish just so it looks pretty. To make it right. nice. Did you to know the nice. coffee beans float? Did you know that? I, I, now look I know. Look at that. Look at that now. <laughs> only ours. <laughs> only ours. Only, only They're ours. magic beans. Mm. We sold them to Jack How as well. It? It's good. It's yeah. very good. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Okay. All right, so, so what's our second drink? So this is our Rainier Square Spritz. Mm -hmm. This is the start here. And ooh, there it is. Here's the jigger. And uh, actually, this one, also very, very difficult. Can I get out of our... <laughs> <laughs> this one has a little bubbles, right? That's yes, not very ma nice. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Actually, the bubbles make it quite nice. Mm -hmm. um, gives it a very refreshing flavor, very refreshing taste mm -hmm. over the summertime. This is great if you're trying to go long in the morning. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Always good. All right. What's it like when you guys walk into into Fonte Bar? Was it what, what can people expect when they walk in? On the on the one side, the morning side, it's it's white marble, very mm -hmm. light and airy, mm -hmm. uh, very traditional coffee bar, European traditional coffee bar, and then in the evening, it gets dark mahogany wood kind of color, so it's it's warm, cozy fireplace, that sort of thing. Love mm -hmm. it. I love that you call it like echoing to European coffee bar because I, I recently got back from, from Greece and there were quite a few establishments where I saw people transition from the, from the cappuccino to a spritz. Yeah. Yeah. No, well, it's it's pretty common. This in is why you don't do it at home. <laughs> <laughs> we made a we a made spill. a little it looks splash. Good. It's okay. But it looks fantastic. That's a quality beverage. This that is beautiful. I right. can't wait to try. Here we go. Give it a shot. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's good. Mm. 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 Mm.
That's refreshing. Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. Yeah, wow. Excellent. Excellent. Every morning you could start your day that way. <laughs> exactly. That's a, that's not endorsed. That's a, that's a good idea. Uh, not for me. <laughs> <laughs> I still have to work in the morning. Yeah. Uh, but you guys have a great variety of coffee yes. that people can buy. Some are earthy, some are more uh, fruity. Tell us about the unique coffee flavors so, as well. So as I said, we've we've been around for 31 years now. The the company, and I started it with another guy that was the master roaster at Starbucks, the first master roaster at yeah. Starbucks. So we've been doing these coffees from all over the world forever and all that kind of good stuff. Everything we do is for varietal character. That is with the way we source the coffees. So when you say you want fruit and that sort of thing, we'll go to Northeast Africa. Africa to find the fruit that we're looking for, maybe in a, in a real uh, a Harar that would be an Ethiopian Harar that would demonstrate that part of the world. And or if you go into Central America, say you, you, you wanted something like, say, from Costa Rica, where we're looking for acidity that would show well in, in a like the F2 espresso for when you're having a little bit of milk or something like this on uh -huh. top of the on the top of the espresso, so it all comes through. So the varietal character is the key to coffee and bringing out that varietal character and the roast is the trick. So the roast Excellent. intonation, we call it, that is what we're all about in expressing what these coffees have. Beautiful. Very cool. Very Absolutely. cool. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for joining us Thanks today. You guys. Yeah. Thank you. Awesome. Awesome. Cocktails. It's all amazing. Shakes. Thank shakes. Thank you very much. Shakes and high fives all around. Uh, we posted a link for more information on Fonte Bar up on our website, fox13cl.com slash studio13live. Thanks so much, guys. Thank Still you. ahead. We're